So how long have you two been together? Uh, three years. Three years. I remember sitting in the dining room, eating my supper, and this little man comes up to me. I, I came right on up to her. I said, hi, my name is Melvin. I'm 72. I'm lactose intolerant. How's the gelatin? But first, what's your name? I said Georgie. There's a lovely name. Well, no one wants to continue on with the name The Ex-Bride of Frankenstein. No, no, no. Anyway, he sat down, and I commented on how nice his teeth were. I told her I was a dentist, and have you ever gone to a dentist with bad teeth? No, you haven't. What is the hardest part of growing old? It's flexibility. Now, when you're old, there's certain things that are mm, more difficult. You need to work hard every day to make things easier. If you don't, things can fall apart. Believe me, I've been there. It's a lot of work to get an arm reattached, especially ones that's the same size. You want to know the hardest. Knowing that you can't control how your family will turn out. You live all this life hoping that you set a good example. And after leaving a legacy for the younger generation, you... Uncle D! ...assume that they can take care of the rest. I think I just lost my appetite. And then it all turns into one big glittery mess. You just lost your food. The hardest part is... I'll take your time. Not having enough time to do the things you want to do. No, you gotta just keep busy. Just, you know, find something to do. Get into a habit. Stick with it. It's difficult, but it's, it's necessary. And it's worth it if you want to live happily. It's just too easy to give up. Nowadays, the holidays are coming back. Oh, and she loves to dress up. Halloween is my favorite. I'm so glad to spend it with such wonderful family. What? <laughs> no. This, uh, holiday is just a bunch of kids making us look weak and toned down. You're going to have to give me a moment to find a way to care less. It's such a busy time. There's still so much to do before, but I enjoy it. Mm -hmm. I wasn't willing to compromise for a, a long time. I'm sure it caused lots of problems. Probably lots of hurt too. You know what? Be flexible. The hardest part is losing them. I'm sorry guys. Georgie passed away this afternoon. Again. She seemed to go peacefully. I'm so sorry. Not having enough time. But we have to pick ourselves back up and be happy with the life that they had left behind. She said she liked my teeth and I should smile more. Everyone should smile more. Because things won't be the same because she was here. I won't be the same.